Hey everybody. So today I'm going to show you the, what I got from the recent rock hunt event from my rock club. If you guys uh, watched the podcast that I was on from the Rock Counting podcast, I talked a little bit about it. I was hoping I was going to be able to film the event, um, but being that it was on private property of one of our members, I um, wanted to be respectful and not video um, any of the actual event because um, um, just for his privacy. So um, I had a really great time. It was a big rock hunting event um, on 50 acres where they scattered a bunch of different rocks all over the property and we had to go hunt for them and um, bring my daughter and her friend and we had a blast and so I'm just gonna show you um, what we found and what we got from that uh, hunt and um, yeah and I just want to encourage anybody to um, join your local rock club I mean the benefits are invaluable the knowledge that you gain the friends that you meet the people that you meet are just absolutely um, spectacular I mean I call them they're, they're like my second family now <laughs> they're definitely part of the rock family and I've just learned so much and I just encourage y'all join your rock club because uh, then you'll be part of cool cool events or could be part of cool cool events like this one and come home with awesome stuff so anyways let's check out what I got I think it's totally funny too you could see <laughs> my uh, phone and my glasses <laughs> anyway let's check out what I bring home home this is freaking awesome guys I'm gonna try to stand back enough here so you guys can see this is the the whole hall right here but uh let's let's get in here and check some of these out these were uh oh I didn't want to get that wet but this was a thunder egg with some just spectacular spectacular juicy crystals really really awesome piece and this beautiful thunder egg. Look at that. Just stunning. And then other other pieces. I'll try not to uh, spend too much time, but another thunder egg. And then uh, we got some mahogany obsidian. Beautiful, beautiful pieces. Of mahogany here oh just stunning and then you guys oh you recognize this piece look at that the president of the club was nice enough to slab a piece of that rock from his house that big big huge Jasper agate he knew I loved it so much too Look at that. He actually slabbed me a piece of that. Look at that. <laughs> Isn't that just spectacular? Oh, so that was a special, special piece right there. And then look at this bad boy. Guys, huge, huge septarian. Look at how big this sucker is. I mean, it is big that is just so cool so so cool septarians made of limestone aragonite and calcite sometimes barite as well oh but that that just is one cool piece and then right here we got an awesome piece of mexican crazy lace see if I can oh covered in druzy in a lot of spots look at that those crystals in there too amazing let's see if I could zoom in and look at that 
awesome piece. It's so heavy. I'm shaking a little bit. Sorry if it's shaky. Big piece of crazy lace. That'll be fun. Let me zoom back out just so you can see this big, humongous jasper agate that just, oh my gosh, I can't even believe I was able to dig this. Oh, oh my gosh, with me. Look at that. Look at that. Let's zoom in a little bit here. Oh, okay. Oh, I can't. This is so heavy. Okay. Stay up. Stay up. Okay. It's already drying. It's a hot day, guys. Look. Beautiful, beautiful, humongous jazz bagot. Yeah, I'm pretty, pretty happy with that piece. And then we got all sorts of goodies over here. Let me get them wet. Try and do some of these fast. But uh, just some awesome huge chunks of of jasper and jasper agate all this here it's pretty well some form of jasper um, and agate except for this awesome um, poppy awesome awesome poppy just covered and beautiful, beautiful orbs. If I could get it all wet, there we go. You might be able to see it better. Just a sick piece of poppy. I can't believe that was in in the mix of things to take. And then we got this big piece of green aventurine. Aventurine. And then all sorts of uh, plume agate and mossy agate. Here's a mossy agate. Look at that. Super cool. And we got bad boys like these. Let's get that wet. Check it out. Some beautiful, beautiful plume with dendrites which is usually uh, manganese oxides got this cool piece look at that this is one big plume as well with some awesome formations and dendrites look at that I mean Oh my goodness, people donated, donated uh, rocks for this event, so this is from multiple members of the, of the club donating awesomeness for everyone to find and come home with. And look at that, botroidally, botroidal awesomeness and plumage, look at the plumage. So cool. So cool. I think these are some of these maybe even graveyard point. Like this one here. Oh gosh, let's let's zoom in on that. Look at that. Look at those plumes. What a beautiful piece. Beautiful piece. That one's another really nice one. Look at that. Just look at that. Awesome piece. Oh, I'm going to have lots and lots of fun. 
playing with these. Look at that. Agate all in there. Look at that. It's so cool. Beautiful plumies. That formation on top. Look at that. Just stunning. And we got pieces of a chert in here. Different pieces. Jasper and chert. Bunch of different agates over here we got montana some waterline awesomeness more like plumy coolness carnelians look at all them carnelians and just some funky cool pieces here and big chunkers. That's a big chunk. Agate right there. Look at that. Look at that. Super awesome piece. Look at it glow. Gosh, that's so cool. Huge chunker. As you can see it doesn't go all the way through typical typical carnelian this fools ya Ugh. and then another another chunky there you can actually see though some banding in that that's a nice but look at that in my hand that's a nice chunk nice chunk <laughs> I've never found anything that big. Oh, I'd trip out. And then we, of course, got some beautiful, beautiful pieces of petrified wood. Oh, this is a big, big piece. And a really, really nice piece, too. Pet wood. Look at that. Look at the grain in that. Beautifully preserved. Beautiful specimen. Awesome green patterns. Look at that. Look at that. Let's get it wet. Obviously it was used with the oil sauce so the water just wants to roll off. But look at that. Beautiful piece. And then we got some Montana petrified wood. A good chunk of that some other really pretty pieces here this one's super agatized oh super agatized piece here just absolutely beautiful look at that look at that just a stunning stunning piece I mean look at it glowing just amazing and then uh, I'm gonna save my favorite favorite absolute favorite piece for last this one right here and this is a flame agate with pink amethyst and uh, here on the on the side right here is hematite coated you can see amethyst I didn't want to get it wet so you could actually see this thing sparkling. So beautiful. But now I'll get it wet so you can see that absolutely stunning flamage. I'm going to even zoom in here a little. Look at that. Okay, Jason from Rock Hounding Life. This reminds me of what you find that I've been so, 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 so jealous of. <laughs> it's just, I mean, absolutely breathtaking. Absolutely breathtaking. This, I, I think, is my prized piece of the day. 
I, I, I about cried. About cried when I, they let me take that home. So look at that. Look at that. <laughs> so I highly, highly, highly encourage, like I said, everyone to uh, join their ro local rock clubs because uh, you can be part of amazing events like the one I was part of and find some awesome, awesome material, gain some knowledge, gain some friends, have some fun, and it's just, it's just worth it. So, uh, sorry I couldn't actually uh, film the event, but uh, I definitely enjoy sharing what I bring home with you guys, and I hope you do too. So, have a wonderful rest of your week, and cheers you guys.